A strong man came up to me, tough kind of a guy, and said, uh, I want to thank you, Mr. President, for saving our country. And, and he, had, he had tears coming down his eyes. He had, this wasn't just a statement, because he had tears coming down. A man greeted me at the door, but it happened so much. And he was a strong, tough guy, and he was crying. And he said, Mr. President, thank you for saving America. You have saved America. And he was crying. And I'm telling you, that man, he was tough. He hasn't cried. I don't think he even cried when he was a baby. That's how tough. But he was really crying. I mean, he meant it. The head of a major, major company. I said, have you been to the White House before? Yes, 51 times. I said, oh, good. So you've been to the Oval Office? No, I was never brought to the Oval Office. I said, come on, I'll bring you to the Oval Office. The person came into the Oval Office and started to cry. This is a tough person, by the way. Came into the Oval Office and started to cry. I've had such an incredible experience with the miners. And just a little while ago, backstage, there were nine of the nine. Now, these were tough guys. These are really, these are seriously tough guys. In fact, I looked at him and I said, I wouldn't want to fight these guys. But of the nine, eight of them were crying. And I looked at the ninth, crying out of happiness because they're back. I looked at the ninth guy and said, what's wrong with you? Why aren't you crying? I don't cry, sir. I said, that's OK. That's OK. Eight out of nine were crying with happiness. Steel workers came up to me and they were crying. I mean, there were like eight or nine of them, and only one wasn't. And I said, what's your problem? And I said, I don't cry. I don't cry, sir. But almost all of them were crying, and they were thanking me at the opening of one of the big plants for United States Steel. But these guys, they were crying. We had an audience of steel workers, some of the roughest, toughest people you've ever seen. And half of them had tears coming down their face. I don't know if these people ever cried before in their life, to be honest. Half of them had tears coming down because we opened a tremendous United States steel plant. And the steel workers, I said to a couple of big, strong guys that came up to me, one of them said, thank you, sir, for saving our country. And he was crying. And I'm telling you, he was crying. I don't think this guy cried when he was a baby. This guy never cried. But he said that, and I've had a lot of people say, usually when I'm backstage, I'll, people just say, thank you for saving our country. And I really, at the beginning, thank you. By the way, when I came in backstage, it happens all the time, but when I came in backstage, a very powerful, strong guy was saying, thank you very much. A very, very powerful guy, big, strong guy, with tears coming down in his face, said, thank you, Mr. President, for saving our country. This happens all the time. This happens all the time. Thank you. Tears. Tears. I said, when was the last time you cried? He said, I don't know that I ever cried. Even as a baby, this guy didn't cry. But he was crying backstage. I mean, tears are coming down thanking me, and it's true. People came to me, and they saw me, and they were crying. Men that were tough and strong, women that were tough and strong, they'd see me, their tears coming down their eyes, because I gave them back their property. I gave them back their farms. But I have to say that uh, people were coming up to me, strong people, tough people, with businesses that were 100 years old, people that were pillars of their community, and they had tears in their eyes. You know, every time I come to a venue like this, or any venue, Almost every time somebody comes back and says, big guy backstage, and he goes, sir, thank you very much for saving our country. Thank you very much. Happened a little while ago. Happens all the time. This is a big, tough guy, obviously from North Carolina. This is a guy, he's, he's almost got most of them do have, but this one's too proud to cry. But he had tears, and he just said that, and I have so many people saying that. You know, I just walked in. 
And a big, strong guy grabbed him. And he was almost crying. And it happens every time. And many times. And he said, Sir, Mr. President, thank you so much for saving our country. And, and you know, now I've, I hear it all the time. Those exact words, thank you for saving our country. I've had so many people come up to me, great people, some of them strong and tough, and you know, these aren't emotional people. And they have tears in their eyes. They say, Mr. President, I saw one tonight, came up to me, a man, strong, tough cookie. I wouldn't want to fight him, okay? And he said, Mr. President, he's crying. He said, thank you for saving our country. So many people said that. So many people.